my baby up, get him fed, get him dressed and out the door. So welcome to a little get ready with me. So um, really quick, it's not like I have time for this or anything, but I'm gonna tell you what I've been doing for my um, skincare right now because I've been noticing a little bit of acne. So anyway, so I am using the Tea Tree Cleansing Gel from Lemongrass Spa. It's kind of formulated specifically for like acne prone skin. Um, so I've been using that and following up with the tea tree uh, face cream. Um, and I also I also use the rose water facial mist. Like that's just kind of a staple. But anyways, I have a very simple routine right now. My evening routine is a little more complex. It has been helping tremendously with my acne, which is super exciting. Anyway, so welcome to today's vlog. I don't know if it's gonna be a vlog. Anyway, I'm filming today. So welcome to today's video. Anyways, I need to focus on getting ready or I'm gonna be colossally late. So anyways, thanks for being here. Um, and let's do a quick get ready with me. also from Lemongrass Spa. It's sulfate free, vegan, alcohol free, and cruelty free. Okay, you ready for this? Can you see all of these, there you can kind of see it in the light, all of these little hairs? <gasps> like two months ago I started losing hair and had this crazy postpartum hair loss experience and I was like ah. So I started using the Rosemary Shampoo Bar from Lemongrass Spa and it's kind of known for like helping with hair growth and I didn't really believe it um but now I have all these little baby hairs everywhere. I'd rather see baby hairs rather than like my hair falling out in clumps. Um, but it was crazy because I didn't really expect it to work, but it did, so that was exciting. All right, what do we think of the fit? You know what, I don't really care what you think of the outfit because we're late and I need to keep moving. And yes, the plan is to wear socks. Here's one sock. Where is the other one? Here's a clean sock. They don't match. It's not gonna matter, I'm wearing boots. Let's go. And my bed is not made. Oh well. Update. My baby is still sleeping. I feel so bad waking him up. But I'm literally so late. Oh my word. I'm gonna have to just go get him up. Hey, should we show our friends your outfit? He is wearing a cute little romper from Beloved Clothing Company. They have a new line called Beloved Baby. And um, it's like the cutest. They have the cutest little baby clothes. Anyways, they sent this one to Callan. And it's like our favorite outfit. It has the cutest little hood. Anyways, I just think little baby boys with hoods. Mwah! The cutest! Okay, I'm finally on my way and I'm, I'm so late and I hate being late. So you're probably curious where I'm going and where I'm so late to. Um, so all of the ladies from our church are getting together for a breakfast, just for funsies, um, at like my favorite coffee shop ever. I'm not gonna do any vlogging because like I am going to like enjoy myself. I'm not really interested in like flipping my camera out to be filming all the time, so probably not going to, but I will catch up with you as soon as I'm out of there, so. Yeah. Feeding this child is such a trip. He has two moods. Either he is so excited he can hardly contain his energy, um, or he's totally uninterested and you never know which it's gonna be. <laughs> Home. Goodness, that took 
all morning. I was running some errands after I left the coffee shop, um, but it was a good use of my time. So anyway, I do have some fun things I want to show you, um, but goodness, if I'm going to accomplish anything today, I need to kick it into gear. <laughs> Oh my goodness, baby! You're so fast! Ain't coming to mommy. <laughs> You're too little to be crawling. Yeah! When I tell you that I get nothing done these days, I literally just run after him and rescue him from all of the situations he gets himself into. Where are you going? I'm so bad at vlogging. I guess I'm just out of practice, but I don't know. Anyways, my whole afternoon kind of got away from me. I put Callan down for his nap and he slept for roughly three hours. And during that time, my best friend was here. Um, I was on the phone with my sister and working on replying to some emails, doing some editing. Um, just working on some work-related things, and I decided not to film all of that because I was like, nobody's interested in that. So anyways, um, <laughs> Gallon is awake now, and I have some fun things I wanna show you yet in this video, but I need to get started on that because I need to be starting on supper very soon, so. Okay, so I wanna show you a few clothing items that I received from Inherit Clothing Company. And each of these items are from their new collection, the Prairie Collection. Okay, so this first dress I'm wearing is the Monica window pane dress in black. And it is seriously so comfy. The sleeve detail is like my favorite. The waist is a drawstring, so you can have it as tight or as loose as you want. Hey, what are you doing over here? I wanna say hi. Why don't you come here? So like I was saying, the waist has drawstrings, which is super fun. One of my favorite things about this dress is that um, the length is very modest and <laughs> it's so comfortable. Oh my goodness. Anyways, on to the next item. All right, we have another lovely item from Inherit Clothing Company. Guys, this is the McKenna plaid maxi skirt with functioning pockets and it is fully lined. Everything to love about this particular item of clothing. All right, so this is the Hope Crew Neck. Um, from Inherit Clothing Company. I'm not lying to you when I tell you it's like my favorite item in my entire closet right now. Anyways, um, I am a sweatshirt girl. Most of you know that. What's the problem? So this crew neck is right up my alley and I am a fan. Where are you going? You can't go over there. Can't go there, Anyways, on to the next piece. Okay, so this next dress is also from a hair clothing company, and this is the Andrea Midi dress. I got it in the color olive, um, but it also comes in a really pretty rust color. So true to the name, it is a midi dress, and it is so comfortable. And um, just like the Monica dress, uh, this waistline is also drawstring and functioning, and I love that. Um, anyways, that pretty much wraps it up for all the things I wanted to show you from a hair clothing company. But but I hope you take time to browse over their website. I'll be linking it in my description box, so it will be um, directly beneath this video. I have a discount code for you as well. I'll add that on the screen here. So if I were you, I'd take advantage of the discount. And yeah, if you wanna get yourself some of the fun pieces I showed in this video, or um, yeah, go ahead and look on their website. There are a lot of other fun items that obviously I can't feature in one video. But anyways, um, yeah, I encourage you to go look over their website. Anyways, we need to make supper, so I need to keep moving. There you go. More? Well, come on your chin. More? So for supper, I'm gonna make a recipe from the Magnolia Table Cookbook. If you don't have this cookbook, I recommend getting it. I love it. I picked it up maybe like three months ago, four months ago, and I love it. I'm a huge fan. I love all of the recipes in it so far. Um, but I am making some sour cream chicken enchiladas. Um, unfortunately, I don't think I can share the recipe without the author's permission. I don't know if I can or not, but I'm gonna not share it just to be on the safe side. Um, but I, it is in this cookbook, so if you have it or if you're interested in getting it, um, yeah, it's gonna be on page 193. So there you go. Um, all right, so I'm gonna get started and let's see how this goes. I hope it goes quickly because I am starving. <laughs>
Okay, that recipe was incredibly simple um, and it's baking right now, so I'm gonna quick clean up my mess and yeah, get the dishes, um, everything in the dishwasher. That way, as soon as we're done with like supper, all I have to do is add the, those dishes, um, like our plates and the baking dish, and then I'm done with dishes. So I'm gonna get started on that. I can't wait to show you the enchiladas. I hope they're good. I've never tried this recipe, so I guess we'll see. <laughs> the vlog right here I know this vlog was pretty lame <laughs> but um, yeah my day was just it was kind of all over the place and so I feel like this vlog is very scatterbrained but that is a very good way to describe how my brain felt all day so you know you get what you get here um, on my channel so anyways but thank you for hanging out with me today I hope you enjoyed our time together as much as I did and if you did don't forget to like this video and subscribe to my channel if you haven't and I hope you have a good week. I'll see you in the next one. Bye, guys.